Assalamu alaikum. Shalom alaikum. Peace be with you. Namaste. Good evening, dearest brothers and sisters in the East, and good morning, dearest brothers and sisters in the West. It's another beautiful moment in which to acknowledge that all of our eternal God is present with us, that our beloved Creator is here right now with us. And so, let's pray. Beloved and infinite source of our being, your light shines through the universe and within us at the same time. You, the all-merciful and the all-compassionate, the all-loving, the all-wise. You, the breath in our lungs. You, the beating of our hearts. You, you who love us more than 70 mothers combined. Your love is beyond our capacity to imagine. And yet, we stand on the holy ground of knowing and trusting that your love is sufficient that we have yet to remember that we are so deeply loved by you. And so we thank you for your enduring love and patience and forgiveness. We thank you that we are created to be demonstrators, perfect ambassadors of your peace and love. We're grateful for the examples you have given us in our beloved prophets, Jesus and Muhammad, O oh, peace be upon them both, who have shown us that it is better to light a candle than to curse the darkness. And so today we put aside the habit of cursing darkness and we instead offer ourselves as candles of light, candles of hope, candles of forgiveness, candles of peace. We affirm that there are candles of light, love, peace, and forgiveness at the border of the United States and Mexico, reuniting children with their parents. We affirm candles of peace in our prison yards, in our hospitals, in our nursing homes, in our classrooms, candles of peace in the halls of government, candles of peace in the Middle East, candles of peace in North and South Korea, candles of peace in Syria, Iran, Russia, and the United States, candles of peace in Pakistan, Burma, and India, candles of peace everywhere, for wherever we are, you are, and all is well. Grant that we may always know that we are standing upon holy ground. Grant us the humility to take off our shoes, our earthly understanding, and stand united with you. Stand in awareness that your love for us is so enormous and so strong and so all-encompassing that if we but surrender ourselves to it, we will always know how to live, how to move, how to have our being in you. For your presence, we are grateful. For the opportunity to be ambassadors of your peace, we are grateful. For this now moment, in which we are one sacred, holy family, we are grateful. The, for the remembrance that every child is our child, every mother is our mother, every father our father, every brother and sister our brother and sister, every aunt and uncle and cousin and grandparent, these are all our family. Grant that we may always remember this and put aside the habit of cursing darkness and instead 
welcome the light that you are so that we may be candles of your light. For all of this and more and for what we can't even yet begin to imagine, we're grateful and we say thank you, thank you, thank you. Amen and Amen. Bless you, brothers and sisters. Um, I can't see all of your names, but I am so honored and blessed that you are with me and that we have been in prayer together. It's, um, it's such a sacred opportunity. I'm, I'm truly, truly grateful. And I know that the God of all is shining his light upon us all and that you will have a beautiful, blessed evening with your loved ones and family. If you happen to be by yourself, we are with you. The God of love is with you. You are never alone. Sleep deeply and in deep peace tonight. When you awaken, awaken ready and refreshed to serve our God of love once again. If you are in the West, good morning. Good morning. This is the day our God has made. Let's rejoice Let's be a candle of light for the world today, remembering that wherever we are, God is, and all is well. Bless you, and shalom, God willing. We will see each other tomorrow. <laughs>